Hello Joomla people, my name is Mark and today I'm going to show you how to replace an existing logo on your Joomla site. Most templates come with a generic logo and of course you're going to want to replace that with your own and this video will show you how to do it. Since we're going to be working with original content, it's a good idea to set up a directory or if you'd like a folder somewhere on your hard drive to drop the originals off. This way, if there is some problem that arises or you create something that you do not like, you can easily drop the original back off and start over. To locate the logo, to find out where it actually is on the server, go into your back end and look for extensions and then go down to template manager and then look for the default template. In this case, you'll see the default template is RT Afterburner J15. We're going to click on that and then hit edit. Now one of the things you'll want to do is note the default color style. Not all templates actually have different color styles but if yours does you want to make a note of it because there could be possibly many different images and this will narrow them down for you. So once you've made a note of light style 4 you'll want to go into edit CSS and then notice that we're looking for light 4 CSS. Click on that and click edit again. Once you get inside the template manager you'd like to click inside choose all and then copy and what you're going to want to do here is paste this into a text editor and save it in a safe spot the one I talked about earlier. This way if something should happen you'll have a fresh copy of it you can paste it back and you won't have any further problems. Now once you've done that you'll want to do a search for the term logo because that's what we will be replacing. So in your browser just do a search for L-O-G-O -O, and you'll notice the first thing of course will be logout is highlighted because the word logo is in there and then you will want to find the next and then you'll see logo right here in the header section and of course it explains that the, what the width is, the height and most importantly where it is located. In this case it is located in the images of this particular template and the logo is called light4.png. I've opened up an FTP program and you'll see this is the root directory for the Joomla account. What we will look for is templates right here and then we're going to look for the particular template that we are working on and in this case it was the afterburner and once inside there we'll look for images. Now there's light4.png what we know is the logo that we are looking for we will take this any way that you feel comfortable with sometimes people like to drag it onto their desktop and sometimes people will like to actually use a get or put command whatever it is you feel comfortable with. Once you have the image on your hard drive you can edit it in your favorite image processing program such as Photoshop and then FTP it back with the changes. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to put the new logo back, drop it off to replace the old one and then we will go back to our site and hit refresh sometimes you have to hit it a couple times and you'll see there's the new logo and that is how to replace a logo in an existing Joomla site.